Hello. Today, as I said in my ice cream video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a bear. Now, I made this one huge, but since I already draw it, drew it, not draw it, my grammar, I'm just going to highlight it with my whatever marker this is. <laughs> it's yellow because I lost my orange one. But anyways, so I'm just going to start with the head. So first, this marker doesn't work. Anyways, first you start here, then just curve all the way around till where you want the ears. So right now you need... Gosh, I really need my marker. I can't work without it. It's hard to show you guys. Ooh, here's a marker. So start here. Like that. <laughs> yes, okay. And then also you start doing the ear, which is like curvy shape. Like that. And then I did the exact same thing on the other side. And then in the middle, you're going to do kind of like pointy triangle shapes. And then for the eyes, draw like kind of like a circle triangle thing it's like not quite a circle but it's more like a triangle and then draw two of them and then you draw a big semicircle then on the other side then you draw a tiny circle then an even tinier circle then you color that in. Right now I'm just going to show you the head of it. So then you color the other eye in. Blah, blah, blah. And then for the nose, you just do an oval. And you just keep on drawing and kind of go smaller. Like that. And then for the, excuse me, you do a little, like, dash thing. Here, maybe if I zoom in. Well, sort of. It's not really zooming in. There we go. And curvy. Ta-da. And then you can draw a little bow if you wanted to grow. So first you draw a circle, and you color that in. And then you draw, like, kind of butterfly wings. And you color those in. Then you can draw cheeks. Just kind of like that shape. And then for the body, I'm just going to do this really fast. You make like a that shape, like a paw kind of shape. Just kind of like curved. Then you do your three little lines. Then for the belly, do like a lily pad shape. And for the, do an oval. This is really bad choice because I'm going really fast. Then you connect them. And then ta-da, you have your teddy bear. That was really quick. You can just keep on replaying this video until you get the right answer. Now, since I have enough time, I'm going to show you how to make a teddy bear ring. So on the back of this, I drew my little teddy bear, and I made this one a boy, so I'm just going to outline it.
can see through my picture. But this one, you just draw the head and you draw it kind of small, like really small. My nose isn't exactly oval shape. I made the nose too big, but that big, which is about, I don't know, an inch and a half. I'm not sure about centimeters. I'm sorry if you're not living in America. And I drew a little hat. And then, you have to go get scissors, but what you'll need is duct tape and then a strip for your ring. Make sure it wraps around your finger. It's the right size. So you can slip on and off. Like there. Then you, you can either cut it or rip it. I don't have any scissors with me. And then get your duct tape using zebra. I like to rip it. It's easier than cutting it. So you have this and you put your little piece of paper down. Lay your zebra face down and kind of match up the edges like so. And then fold it. Well first you're going to rip it with about a centimeter left of the sticky stuff. So it can stick. See? And then rip it again. This one wasn't ripping. At the size of your strip. And then fold. Fold this part in. And fold up. You have your ring. And then place on your finger. Unfold. And, and then connect it with that sticky piece right there. Because it should be if you did it right. Then connect it. And you have your ring. And now you cut out your little animal. Um, cut out your little animal. I'm just going to rip it out because I do not have scissors. But you guys would cut it out nice and carefully. But right now, I'm not going to do that. I cut off his hat. No. And then, with the excess piece, you roll it into a loop with all the sticky side like that. Stick it onto the back of your animal and then place it onto your ring. Hold it down for about 10 seconds. And then ta-da, you have your little ring. You can make it smaller if you want. Yeah, if I were you, I would make it smaller about less than an inch. Like, try to draw as small as you can. Like that big, which is about two centimeters by one centimeter. Then just put it, put your little face on. That would be better. So bye guys. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe so we have our little ring. And the bear, which I kind of ripped out of space. Bye guys. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe.